。嗨，各位同学好，欢迎来到 f o l i p h o n i x 自然音标。f o l i p h o n i x 自然音标的课程。今天老师为你介绍的是 vocabulary of the day。vocabulary of the day。同样的，我们今天到 cn.com 去寻找本人的 headline news of the day， 并且从中去了解一些单词的拼音技巧以及逻辑。Okay, students. Let's go to the cn.com edition. cn.com and search for the headline news of the day, and we can probably learn some vocabulary, spelling, and pronunciation rules. Okay, let's take a look at today's headline article: biggest league ever. Panama Papers. What you need to know. Biggest league. Ever, Panama Papers. What you need to know. And today's headline: biggest leak ever. Panama Papers. What you need to know. Okay, let's check out the story from today. And students, remember, if you would like to study with me with this article, simply. From the top right hand side, on top of right hand side, you will see a search menu from CNN, and all you have to do just input the today's headline title he, there. Then we can have the same story to study with. Okay, the article for today is the Panama Papers: Seven Things to Know. The Panama Papers. Seven things to know. Again, the headline for today is the Panama Papers. Seven things to know. Story highlights media coalitions reports that Panama law firm. Help set up secret offshore companies and accounts to hide money. The papers allegedly show a network tied to Russian President Vladimir Putin and other world power players. The documents were reported on by the international. Consortium of the investigative journalists and many other outlets. Okay, the CNN news. CNN on Sunday, the International Consortium of the Investigate Investigative Journalists published a massive leak of documents, dubbed the Panama Papers. CNN money has you covered with. What you need to know about the story and the responses to it. What are the Panama Papers? ICIGN, an international coalition of media outlets, invest investigative the trove of papers which allegedly reveal a clandestine network involving associates. Of Russian President Vladimir Putin and business tie between a member of FIFA's ethics committee and the man who the United States has indicted for corruption. Why are they called the Panama Panama Papers? The the more than eleven million documents which date. Back for decades, are allegedly connected to Panama law firm Mossack Fonseca. I see. I hear reports that the firm helped establish secret shell companies and、uh, offshore accounts for global power players. I see. I hear reports that in、uh, 2015, already found that Mossack. Fonseca knew the identities of the real owners of just two or four of fourteen thousand and eighty-six companies he had incorporated in 
Seychelles and Indian Ocean archipelago, often described as a tax haven. Is it clear anything illegal has happened? The documents do not necessarily in indicate illegal activity, but shell companies and、uh, offshore accounts can be used to mask the origin of、uh, financial transactions and、uh, ownerships. The files include people and companies that the U.S. has. Blacklisted due to the drug trafficking and the terrorism links, according to the ICIJ. Okay, students, if you like this story, you can keep on reading、uh, yourself. And now let's jump onto the vocabulary words. Here is the note I have prepared for you guys to study. First things, let's read the headline with me. Biggest leak ever. Panama Papers. What you need to know. Again, biggest leak ever. Panama Report Papers. What you need to know. Again, biggest leak ever. Panama Papers. What you need to know. Okay, here now is the vocabulary time. We have two vocabulary words for today, and now we are going to discuss the vocabulary's meaning, usage, pronunciation, and definition. We use the spelling bees, pronunciation, and the spelling improvement. Take a look from the first vocabulary words: leak, leak, leak. Verb of a container or covering. Accidentally lose or emit contents, especially liquid or gas, through a hole or a crack. The roof leaked. As the adjective leaking, a leaking gutter. The drone will leaking an un an unidentified liquid. More example sentences. Salvage and rescue workers. Who were rushed to the scene said one of the sunken acid containers was slowly leaking into the river. Origin: Late Middle English, probably of Low German or Dutch origin, and related to lack. The second vocabulary word: Panama. Panama. Panama, also Panama hat. No, a wide-brimmed hat of straw-like material, originally made from the leaves of a particular tropical palm tree, worn chiefly by men. Example sentences: Only buy a Panama hat with a sweat band. Which helps keep your head in place and prevents it from stretching out. Origin: Mid nineteenth century, named after the country Panama. Okay, now it's a time. We're going to repeat the pronunciation and definition part again, and this time I would like you to read along with me. Let's do it together. Leak. 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 Verb. Of a container or a covering, accidentally lose or emit contents, especially liquid or gas, through a hole or crack. The roof leaked. As the adjective leaking, a leaking gutter. The drum were leaking an unidentified liquid. More simple sentences. Salvage and rescue workers who were rushed to the scene said one of the sunken acid containers was slowly leaking into the river. Origin: 
Let me know English probably of low German or Dutch origin and relative to lack. And the second vocabulary word Panama. 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 Also Panama hat. Numb. A white brimmed hat or straw like material. Originally made from the leaves of a particular tropical palm tree, worn chiefly by men. Example sentences. Only buy a Panama hat with a sweat band, which helps keep your hat in place and prevents it from stretching out. Origin. Me, 19th century, then after the country of Panama. Okay, so now it's the time we're going to redefine these two vocabulary words and using phonics, advanced pronunciation and spelling improvement and skill. Take a look at the first vocabulary word leak. 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 How we can leak this word? Its origin. Its origin. 啊，中晚世纪的英文啊，那当然他没有解释出原来的那个字是从哪里变过来的哈。那我们来看 leak 单音节哈，单音节的这啊 one syllable word 哈，那所以我们看它的组合哈，没有重音，所以 onset 开头的它有 onset， 它的 onset 是 l 啊，开头开头的首音是 l， 那尾随的母音。啊，它的 nucleus 在中间，啊是 e a， 啊常常看到的 e a 组合哈、啊，母合音在 e a， 尾音呢，它的 coda， 啊在 k， 啊它的尾音在 k， 啊那我们知道，当 nucleus 加 coda 就等于 rhymes 韵音，好、啊、它的韵音，啊押韵的地方在 e a e。再加 k e e k， 好，所以我们来看它的主要的组合。好，开头 consonant vowel vowel consonant， 好，子母母子，好，或者我们讲辅圆圆辅，好的这个组合。所以取出来它的第一个母音，刚好因为它有两个母音，所以它是这两个母音要做组合。它也就是典型的 e a e， 好，前面的 e 发出长母音。后面的不发音啊，所以我们这样画过来，好画过来，好后面的不发音，前面的发出长母音 ，leak， leak， again， L E A K， consonant vowel vowel consonant， combination vowel and vowel， first vowel long vowel long vowel E， S E， leak。Leak, leak, again. L e a k. Consonant, vowel, vowel, consonant. Combination, vowel and vowel. Long vowel e, e. Leak, 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 leak. 好，我们来看第二个单词啊 ，Panama, P a n. Syllable A, M A. 啊，它巴拿马是个国家哈，所以应该是由西西方西啊西班牙语这边转过来的哈。所以我们来看哈，十九世纪哈过来自啊由这个国家名巴拿马转过来的哈。所以重音有两个重音哈，在一跟三这个地方，一跟三，所以我们的 man stress, man stress. 在第一个音节 ，secondary stress， 次重音，主重音啊，在第一音节，次重音啊 ，secondary stress， 在啊，在我们的第三音节，所以我们把一跟三画出圈圈，那它们就是我们的强音节啊，它们就是我们的强音节 ，strong syllable。Strong syllable. Ah, the one and three. 
weak syllable 啊，我们看 weak syllable 呢 ，weak syllable 弱音节就落在二，因为没有重音，所以找到弱音节第二音节，它只有唯一一个母音，补上一个弱母音符号，通常我们就用 a、呃、这个字放在中间。那一跟三呢？因为有重音啊，所以我们来看它的啊、呃、母音与子音的排列，也就是元音与辅音的排列法。它有 onset， 第一个音节有 onset，onset 是 p， 开头首音是 p， 尾随的 nucleus， 母核音是 a， 母核音在 a，coda， 尾音在 n。音在 n， 所以它的 nucleus 加 coda 就是 a n， 啊，所以它的 rhymes 在 a n 在第一个音节，而第三个音节，我们看它的组合，它是 onset， 是 m， 尾音，啊 ，coda 是 a， 啊，所以它的首音是 a m， 和，啊。合音 ，sorry， 合音 ，nucleus 在 a， 啊，合音在 a， 所以 m 它没有 coda， 所以它就只有 nucleus 在这个地方，而它是尾音，啊，尾音在 a 却发出 r， 所以它是一个破音字，啊，因为它是西班牙语转过来，西班牙语的话 a 都念 r。所以我们现在先把它画过来 ，Panama，Panama， Panama, 好，我们先把它画过来啊，好，那我们先来看哈它的线性，第一个音节 consonant，vowel，consonant，vowel and consonant， 我们知道 v 加 c，vowel and consonant 的组合 ，v 加 c 也就是 v c。所以不管是 v c v c c v c c c， 他们都会等于 short vowels 啊，啊，他们都会发出 short vowels 短母音。所以画法很简单 ，nucleus 跟 coda， 在 coda 这个地方，因为是子音画横线过来，遇到母音降下去，变成短母音 a n a n p a n p a n Pam, short vowels. 第二个音节刚刚讲的是弱母音 pan, pan, pan. 而第三个音节，我们注意到它一般来说尾音 a 又处在重音要念长母音，但是由于它是它是外来语，所以我们直接画个下降的符号，并且上面写个 short vowels， 并且是 variant。啊，它比它是个 variant。它是个破音字了，啊，它念 ma，ma，ma， 所以 short vowels 并且是个 variant。我我们看到单独向下的符号，就已经知道这一定是个破音字了哈。所以我们叫 Panama again。P A N syllable A syllable M A。Main stress first syllable second stress。Third syllable, first syllable consonant vowel consonant combination V and C, short vowels, short vowel A, pan, pan, second syllable weak syllable weak vowel A, paner, 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 last syllable third syllable secondary stress strong syllable, short vowel A. Variant A, ah,、uh, as show vowel O, ma, ma. This we call as variant A, as short vowels O, ah,、uh, short vowel O, short vowel O, ah. Ah, so he to he to strong pronunciation, ha. O 的短母音 R again, P A N syllable A syllable M A, main stress first syllable second stress 
third syllable. First syllable consonant vowel consonant combination V and C. Short vowels short vowel A pan pan pan. Second syllable weak syllable weak vowel A panner panner. Third syllable secondary stress third syllable strong syllable combination consonant and vowel and uh, variant A as a short vowel O R ah, ma 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 Panama 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 好的我们再把这两个单字再做一次的练习 Leak 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 Panama 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 好的以上就是今天的 vocabulary of the day 同学们如果你觉得David老师用这个 Phonic 自然发音的公式带领进入 Phonetic 音表的世界并且用 Phonic Phonic 用线形符号来表达母音发音的可能性如短母音长母音双母音轻母音甚至破音或者有线形符号来表达子音的特殊发音形式如二合子音等等能帮助到你对发音的了解以及记忆的话也欢迎大家用 Google Plus 跟David老师做好朋友用 Google Plus 叫David老师 other friends, if you like my pronunciation skills and rules and you would like to become my friends, simply just use Google Plus and find my ID David TDING88 and join me with a friendship on Google Plus. Or I'm also using Weibo and my Weibo account is David TTING88. Again, and my email is David Ting88 at hotmail.com. If you would like to write me an email, here's my email account. And I'm also use WeChat again. My WeChat ID is David Ting88. Thanks for your video watching and sharing on my to my YouTube channel. If you like my YouTube videos, don't forget subscribe to my YouTube channel. 不要忘了喜欢David老师的教学的话，还是要订阅我的频道。欢迎大家收看以上就是今天的 vocabulary of the day。每日单词，谢谢各位观赏。